Adrian made this. What's up with it? It's your boy McFly, man, the hardest working man in shoe tainment today. Coming at you again with another real review. If this is your first time over here in Atlanta, McFly, welcome to you, man. I appreciate you stopping by. Hopefully you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell, man, and become a freaking flyer. Join the winning team, man. We out here grinding. <laughs> For sure, man. Uh, we also got a new goal set. We're trying to hit 500 subs by Jane. No, not January. We're in January. Trying to hit 500 subs by April 1st, man. That's what we're doing the good old month of April. So if you know somebody, tell a friend, tell anybody, man. Homeless people, whoever, as long as they got a cell phone, I don't care. Trying to get these views, man. Being honest. But as you can see by the box on the table, man, we're making a trip to Hype Beast Country again. I don't travel here too often, as most of you who've been, you know, following me for a while know. But um, I figured it'd be a good time to uh, do this review since I didn't do it the first time around with these uh, re-releasing here soon. So I figured we killed <laughs> two birds with one stone. Man. As you can see, we got the butter, butter, butter Yeezys in that grown man size 14. Like I always say, man, if you wear 13 and up, you should definitely be subscribed to my channel, man. It ain't too many big footers out here winning like me, man. Well, actually, I don't know no other big footers on the two. A couple 13s, but I don't know no 14s or 15s, you know, that's doing videos or nothing. So feel free to follow me. <laughs> For sure. But uh, for those of you who are familiar, and for those of you who are not familiar, we're going to get you zoomed in for this close-up action. All right, man. We got you locked and loaded with this close-up action on these bad boys. While my size tag heads, y'all can go ahead and uh, snap your picture or whatever so you can get that close-up on them. You know? All right. Yeah. Oh, also, the tags. Like, this is a pair that I've already had, so get you a close-up on that tag. I can't tell if that's focusing or not, so if it ain't, worst case, I'll put a, uh, I'll put a snippet in for it or whatnot. Yeah, because I can't really tell, so. At any rate, <sighs> what you here for? These shoes, man. Now, like I said, man, I'm not a huge Yeezy head. I'm not the biggest fan of Yeezys or whatnot, but when they get it right, they get it right. This shoe was probably one of the more simpler colorways, and um, it really hit the spot. Like, you can do a lot of grown man things with this soft, um, this butter yellow, and really, um, I don't know how the camera's picking it up, but it's kind of hard to tell that it's really yellow. Like the laces, you can tell just like the Wave Runner laces um, is how these are, the same color. But the, the yellow, the yellowish hue is so, you know, subtle. You know, it's kind of hard to tell, but you can do so much tone-wise with these. Um, this, is, this is comprised of a all prime knit upper. You know, can't really beat that. It really conforms to your foot or whatnot with your flat butter-colored laces. Um, you do have your 3M stripes in the back back here. Your butter pull tab and your little tan here on the bottom with your, I guess we can call it gum <laughs> outsole. You know, that's what we're going to do here today. Put a little bit of miles on them, man. You got full length boost in these, of course which, um, you know, it took me a while to really conform to Boost and admit that Boost was really dominating the game, you know, at that point in time when Boost was really killing. I mean, they still killing it now. You know, I've got some other comfortable shoes, but not too much, anything comfortable than these Yeezys, the, um, the, damn, what are them things called? The Yeezys. The, uh, damn, this is escaping me. Yeah, the Yeezys, the Ultra Boost. <laughs> I don't know why I couldn't get Ultra Boost out. And the premium um, NMDs, man. Like, those are the way to go. I've got some other Adidas shoes, too, that are comfortable as well. But those really take the cake, man. The Ultra Boost, follow in this order now. The Ultra Boost, followed by the Yeezy, followed 
by the premium NMDs. Uh, maybe the EQTs, the 9317s, those are pretty comfortable too. So it's kind of a toss up between NMD and 9317s with the EQTs, but it is what it is, man. Simple, to the point, basic, none of that extra striping or none of that, just all solid color, one shoe. I'm sure the re-release will be the same. I actually won these on a reservation from uh, Foot Locker, if I didn't say that already. Foot Locker got me hooked up with these. And um, yeah, that's it, man. Your butter butters. And uh, I guess I'll go ahead and do an on foot, man, for everybody wondering, you know what I'm saying? We'll go ahead and hop into this on foot action. All right, man, we locked and loaded on this on foot action. Um, I don't really think you'll find too many shoes that can compete with the Yeezy when it comes to comfort. Um, this shoe automatically, I'm, we're just going to jump straight to shoe grade. This shoe automatically gets an A, man. Automatically, off rip. If you're going for comfort, get you a pair of Yeezy, Yeezy, Yeezys, man. Get you some. Yeah, they're expensive, so what? They're worth it. That's all I can really say. I'm not the hugest fan of Yeezys, though, man. I'm not one of those all Yeezy guys and all that. I've only really got a handful of pair. I've got these Butters, I've got the Zebras, I've got the Wave Runners, and that's it. There was a couple others that I liked, but wasn't in no rush to get them, didn't have to have them. But, um, yeah. Yeezys, man. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what else to tell you. Either you like them or you don't like them, but you can't deny the comfort of this shoe, man. I try to put like my homies on, and some of them on the head, some of them don't, man. It's like, bro, <laughs> one, one day you're gonna put your foot in something boost, and your whole life gonna change. But until then, it is what it is, man. It's your boy McFly. The butter's coming back. How y'all feel about it? Until next time, I'll holler at you.